and welcome to the morning announcements with Billy Peyton, aka Pilly. Billy. So, Peyton, how about those sophomores? In recent Powderpuff games, sophomores dominated seniors with a 20 to 12 win. Go to sophomores! After already dominating the juniors 0 to 12, and here's our sports section. Hello, I'm Gabby. I'm going to be talking about the sports. This is not relating to the sports, but the following students were selected for All-State Honor Choir, which will take place in January. They are August Tuggle, Sidney Mitchell, Nolan Snyder, and Elijah Miller. At the volleyball game on the 19th against Evansville Wrights, the, the freshmen lost in two sets, the JV lost in two sets, and the varsity won in five. The JV football beat North Posey Monday night on September the 19th, 20-0. The varsity football on homecoming Friday won 26-15 over North Posey. The boys soccer on September the 15th won 2-1 over Pike Central. The boys tennis on September the 15th lost to Northeast Dubois 0-5. The girls soccer on 9-17 win over Mount Vernon 5-0 home turf. And before I go, I want to tell you a little joke. What lights up a soccer stadium? <laughs> a soccer match. Bye. Thank you, Gavin. Thank you. So, have you heard that we have a new king and queen for football homecoming 2016? Of course. <laughs> like the biggest news ever. And our king is Caleb Hoffman and our queen, Miranda Miller. Miranda, and, uh, were you surprised to be crowned football homecoming queen? Yes, definitely. I think that it was a huge honor to even be on the homecoming court. Um, but I think that everybody that was on the homecoming court definitely deserved to be there. I want to thank everybody who voted for me. And I'm very blessed and honored to be your homecoming queen. Speaking of the student body, do you have anything to say to them like as a whole? I want to tell them that they've done a really good job at supporting our school with the Spirit Nights and such, and I think that we're off to a great year. Go Patriots! And here's a word for our homecoming king, Caleb Hoffman. Were you surprised when you won the homecoming king? Yes. And how did it make you feel? Awesome. Do you have anything you want to say to your fellow classmates at Harry Chills about it? Thank you for voting. Thank you for voting. Our Queen Miranda Miller, and now for the weather. Hello, I'm Gavin. I'm doing the weather for, for next week. Saturday, it's supposed to be sunny, even Sunday, very sunny. For Monday, it's going to be partly cloudy, just depends on the time and where the sun's at. For Tuesday, it's going to be sunny most of the time. For Wednesday, we might get a little rain here and there. For Thursday and Friday for next week, it will be partly cloudy again. Unless it changes, because it's the 21st of September. Catch me next week. Bye. Thank you, Gavin. Thank you. Hello there. I'm Chris Osford. <laughs> and I'm Kaylee Marshawn. And today we present to you the Meme of the Week. Meme of the Week. This week's freshly handpicked meme is a meme of the famous memester, Gooby. <laughs> Gooby was, became famous for being an improperly drawn Goofy from Mickey Mouse and Friends. In this week's Gooby meme, Gooby appears to be stealing his own hat, breaking many of the known laws of physics, and then he proceeds to break down as his hat has been stolen. Okay. Um, which country are you from? I'm from Germany. What is the most exciting thing about being a part of the Foreign Exchange Student Program? Um, probably meeting new people, learning the language and the culture and stuff. What kinds of things have you gotten involved in, in or plan to get involved in here at Harry Chills? 
Um, I'm playing soccer here, and I want to try out for basketball. What do you hope to take away from this experience? Um, maybe to improve my language, um, to have new friends, yeah, that's <laughs> and gain experience. Hi, we are here with our foreign exchange student at Heritage Hills High School. Her name is Lisa. Hi, Lisa. How are you? Hi, I'm fine, thank you. Uh, what country are you from? I'm from Norway. Nice. What is the most exciting thing about being a part of the Foreign Exchange Student Program? I think it's to get to know people all around the world, and since I've never been in America, it's fun to experience that. Yes. What kind of things have you gotten involved in, or you plan to get involved in here at Heritage Hills? Uh, I'm planning on tryout for the softball team, and I'm also in the FFA. And what do you hope to take away from this experience? I want to gain more experience about different cultures and meet new people. Well, thank you for your time, Lisa, and I hope you have a great year at Heritage Hills. Thank you. This is Sifra, and this is Hannah. What country are you from? I'm from Norway. I'm from Holland. What is the most exciting thing about being part of a foreign exchange student program? Mm, that must be to experience the culture and trying to do something else in a school year. Mm -hmm. Meeting new people. Yeah. And what kinds of things have you guys been involved in or what do you plan to be involved in here at Heritage Hills? I play soccer and I'm in pep club and FCA club. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, we do a lot of fun stuff in soccer. So I like that. I joined the volleyball team. <laughs> nice. What do you guys hope to take away from this experience? I hope that I will learn a lot about the United States and your culture. And I hope that I will be better in English. And that I learn more about myself and get new friends. Exactly the same. Okay. Well, thank you for your time, and I hope that you guys enjoy your year. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for watching our first ever morning announcements. And this is Pilly, signing off.